Hey, how's it going? Today I'll show you the easy way to install TV Mate Live TV Player to your Fire Stick or Android TV. TV Mate is an extremely easy to use and super stable live TV player that a lot of people use. So if you're looking for a simple but still great live TV player, TV Mate might be the best choice for you. Now let me show you how to get it to your device. First of all, you have to get an app called Unloader. You can actually get it for free from the official Amazon App Store. To do so, we need to go to search on your device, so click on that magnifying glass right here, and there is a search bar, so we click on it, and here in the search you need to type the loader, so let's do it. As you can see, there was even no need to enter whole name of the app because the loader already popped out for us at the bottom, so we click on it, and that's the app which we need to get to our device. However, after you get the loader, it's not over yet, we still have to set it up. And to set up the loader, we actually gotta go to settings. So let's do it. There are settings. Then we scroll down and click on My Fire TV. So open it. And from here, you have to enable developer options for your Fire Stick device. However, on some Fire Sticks, and especially on the new Fire Sticks, the developer options can be hidden by default. So if that's the case, do not worry, it's really easy to make them appear. To do so, you just gotta go to About, select Fire TV Stick. And now you have to click on the middle button on your remote for 7 times and do it fast. So let's do it. As you can see, now on the bottom for me it says no need, you are already a developer. That's in my case. In your case it's going to say that you have become a developer now. And if you go back a bit, you will finally see developer options, which have appeared right here. So we open them, make sure to enable ADB debugging, then go to install unknown apps. From here, locate the loader and make sure to turn that option on. So basically, what it does is going to allow you to install other applications from the internet and not necessarily only those which are only available in the official Amazon App Store. And that's exactly what we're going to do right now. So now we have to go to the list of apps on your device. There it is, let's open it. And now in the list of apps, you'll actually find the loader, which is kind of set up and ready to use. However, before actually using the loader, there's one more thing which I really recommend doing. It's of course connecting to a VPN. In my case, I mostly use NordVPN. Because they're super fast, we got a great app for Fire Sticks, Android TVs, phones, laptops, or pretty much any other device you may use. And they're not expensive for such a premium service. In fact, they cost less than a cup of coffee per month, which is great pricing for us, the users. In the VPN app, you just connect to any server, let's say I will connect to Denmark right now, and from the moment you connect, all your traffic is going to be totally encrypted. It means nobody can track you or snoop on you online, and that's really important if you wish to stay out of trouble. And if you don't have a VPN yet, but you'd like to try it out, I do have a great offer for you. If you use my link, which will be in the pinned comment below the video or in the description of the video, you'll get 3 months of NordVPN totally for free which is an amazing offer. And if you're watching this video on your TV or on your Fire Stick, then just grab your phone or your computer, open up a web browser and go to topvpnoffer.com. That's my website, which is going to give you the same amazing deal for NordVPN with three months for free. Or just scan the QR code, which you can see on your screen right now with a camera of your phone. It works the same way and it's also going to give you three months for free. And now finally, let's use the loader safely. So now let's finally open the downloader application. Let's wait until it loads. Then on the left side menu, we need to click on home, that's important. And here in that search bar, we'll have to enter a link, which is going to be tvmate.com. So let's do it. So it's tvmate. Dot com. So you can see the whole link on the screen right now, make sure to enter it exactly as you see and do not make any mistakes, because obviously if you make any mistake, your link is not going to work. After that you have to click on go and the TV Mate website is going to open up. Now what we have to do is just scroll down until you find the download APK button right here. So that's exactly the button which we need to click on, so we click on it and wait until the load starts, that happened really fast. After that, you have to click on install and wait until TVMate is installed to your Fire Stick. Then, do not click on open yet, 
Instead, press on Done, because here we'll have an option to delete the installation file, as we really do not need it anymore on our device. So click on Delete and then delete once again. This way, we save some space on your Fire Stick, because, well, you don't really have too much free space on your device anyway. After that, finally, let's go to the list of apps on the Fire Stick. There it is, let's open it. Then scroll down to the bottom, and there you'll find TVMate application, which we just installed. Now, I would recommend you to click on the Options button on your remote. That's the button with three horizontal lines. Click on it, and then press on Move to Front. This way, TVMate is always going to be at the very top of your application list, and it's going to be really easy for you to access the app every time you need it. Then again, don't forget to keep your VPN connected to stay safe and out of trouble online. And once again, you can use my link below the video or just go to topvpnoffer.com to get three months of service totally for free, which is an amazing offer. And then, safely, let's open the TVMate application and see what's inside. So here, first of all, you have to add your playlist. To do so, we click on the Add Playlist button. And there are basically two main ways to do so. It's either the M3U playlist link, which is probably the most popular way to add IPTV playlists. Here you just click on Enter URL, and in that bar you need to enter a link which you get from your live TV provider or from your IPTV service provider, whatever you call it. And then you would click on the Next button, and then click on Next here and the playlist is going to appear in the list. However, you can also use Xtreme codes, to do so you would click on that button, and from here you add address, which once again you get from your provider, username and a password. As previously, you click on next, and the playlist is going to appear. And that's it, that's the easy way to get TVMate app to your Fire Stick and to use it on your device. Make sure to subscribe my channel for more content on Fire Sticks, and see you next time. Bye bye.